Hey gang, welcome back to another video. Hope you guys are having a great day today. Thank you so much for joining me on this video today. I wanted to have a fun video today talking about older perfumes that we've only gotten in the smaller sizes, the travel size. We've never gotten these fragrances in full size perfumes and three of them. I'm not sure why because they are so good in the perfume. So I'm not sure why we never got the full sizes. Sometimes they'll release collections at least a year and two years ago they would release a fragrance they would give us like the mini perfume and we were like never saw the full size perfume so i do have four of them here in my collection so we'll be going over midnight amber glow we have the summer melody we have sunset glow and then we also have fall in bloom so yes, let's get started uh, talking about these fragrances and why they never came out in full sizes. So let's start off with one of my favorites and that is Summer Melody. I love Summer Melody as a fragrance. It is so good. So we have scent notes of Golden Honeydew and Bronze Vanilla. I have one body lotion left and I think I have one dry shampoo. That's all I have left in my Summer Melody collection and then this mini perfume. I so wish they would have brought this out in the full size. So let me get out my little tester strips here that I got from Amazon. I got these a while ago and I still have some left. There was like, um, I forget how much it was, but it was like $6 for 200 of them. And they are still lasting this long. Okay, so Summer Melody, it has the honeydew. It's got like a, a melon and like a vanilla smell. But for some reason put together, it's so good. I'm not usually like a huge fan on like a cucumber or honeydew, cantaloupe, those kind of melons. Oh, it does something in this fragrance, though. It has to be the bronze vanilla. Oh, it smells so good. It does smell golden and, like, just so summery. And um, somebody had mentioned, I want to say it was Melissa C. here on YouTube. She had said that it kind of, like, uh, gives her, like, a watermelon bubblegum kind of scent. And ever since she said that, like, I can't unsmell that. It really does have that kind of watermelon, bubble gummy, candy scent. And that just makes me want it, like, in the full size even more. So hopefully they bring back Summer Melody. It's just absolutely an amazing summer scent. Yeah, I'm going to be really, really sad when this bottle of lotion is gone and if they never bring it back, but hopefully one day they will. Such an amazing fragrance. Yes. Okay, so let me know what you think of Summer Melody. Would you like to see it back in the uh, body care? Would you like to see a full-size perfume like me? I think they could do probably just like a classic square bottle maybe with like a yellow and orange design with like maybe the sun on it or something like that. I think that would be really, really cool. Okay, next up, let's do my other favorite and that is Midnight Amber Glow. This is such an amazing fragrance. I have just a little bit left in here and then it will be gone. So it's Smooth Amber, Caramel Latte and Vanilla Bourbon. Let's go ahead and spray it here. Yeah, oh no, I think this might be the end. Oh, it's so good. I mostly get like the caramel and the latte, the vanilla bourbon. I mostly get the smoothness of the amber with the like caramel, vanilla, like coffee latte kind of vibe. It's so, so good. So yeah, I do have a little bit left of like the lotion, the shower gel, a little bit of a body cream. It's absolutely amazing. I'm surprised they never brought back Midnight Amber Glow because it's like such an amazing fragrance. Oh, is this the body wash? No, this is the body lotion. Oh, it's so good. Uh, definitely getting the caramel a coffee vibe, that vanilla bourbon. It's a little like sweet. 
Oh, it's so good. So yeah, I'll be a uh, sad once Midnight Amber Glow is gone as well because it's such an amazing fragrance. Yes, really, really good for fall season. And I think they would have done like such a good job on the full size perfume for this one. Yeah, I can't stop smelling it. It's like along the lines of kind of like the same family as maybe Vanilla Romance, Bonfire Bash. Where it has the vanilla, the bourbon, some like smoothness to it. Really good for fall. Oh, it's just so good. So yeah, hopefully Midnight Amber Glow will make a return. So let me know what you think about that one. All right, next up we have Sunset Glow. Well, Sunset Glow is a really, really good smelling fragrance. It just doesn't really like perform well on my body chemistry. I think this one, yeah. So this one is empty. Uh, I don't even have any perfume left for Sunset Glow. I do have the Fine Fragrance Mist, though. Uh, it's fresh coconut, sparkling cherry seltzer, dreamy moonflower, and caramelized vanilla. Now, I do know that the body spray, the body lotion, and, uh, like, the shower gel, the body cream, none of that really, like, reacted well to my body chemistry. But I will say the perfume did. The perfume smelled really good. It had, like, a cherry vanilla floral with a little bit of that like summery coconut yeah i mean it's a really good fragrance i wish that like it really lasted on my skin like uh not lasted but i wish it smelled really good on my skin like i really wish it just reacts to me well but for whatever reason it just doesn't uh and that's just to me i put this on and my mom said it smells really really good on me but for some reason when i smell it i just don't like it so yeah, these are the one, uh, this is on that list of it's such a good fragrance, just not on me. That is Sunset Glow. I know that one is a favorite for a lot of people. All right, and then the last one that we have here is going to be Fall in Bloom. So the Fall in Bloom, I only have this mini perfume. I never purchased uh, any of the body care for some reason. So this actually has scent notes. I got this off of Google. It says, uh, Juicy Plum, Wild Blooms, and Velvet Moss. Oh, this one is so strong. It's so good also. I'm definitely getting the fruitiness from that Juicy Plum. And the Wild Blooms gives it like a floralness. But it's like a, a fruity floral, so it's not like overpowering on like that floralness. And I love me a good plum note as well. I love anything with plum in it. I pretty much have loved from Bath and Body Works. And I don't know what velvety moss, I don't know what that's kind of giving it. Um, but it does have like a velvety kind of like smoothness to it. Yes, it has the juicy plum, a little bit of floral, a little bit of that velvet moss. It's really, really good. This is really good for... Man, I would wear this in the spring. I would wear this in the fall. Yeah, such a good scent. I wish I would picked up more of the body care, but maybe they'll bring it back one year. Maybe we'll get a full-size perfume. Because I know that this one was a favorite, too. I think we only seen this one one time, and then we never seen it again. So let me know what the gang thinks of the... Ooh, let me get this right here. What do we think of the mini perfumes that we've never gotten in the full-size perfume? I think uh, Summer, or yeah, Summer Melody and Midnight Amber Glow. Those would be like my top two if we could get one back, uh, like repackaged with a full-size perfume. Uh, I would always say uh, when I first started my channel, I was like, they never repackage perfume, so get it while it's out. And then this year, all of a sudden, they've been repackaging uh, like Butterfly, uh, Into the Night, they repackage, oh, what was that other one? Uh, Into the Night, Butterfly, oh, A Thousand Wishes, they repackage that one as well. So maybe one day we'll get these fragrances back, but uh, definitely let everyone know in the comments which one's your favorite, which one would you like to see back, and maybe one day, if Bath & Body Works is listening, maybe they'll bring it back. But thank you so much for joining me on this video. I hope you guys have a great Sunday, and uh, I will catch you tomorrow in a new video, and uh, we have something special coming up this week as as well uh, on the 17th so i'm so excited for that so thank you so much for watching and i will catch you in the next one